one infrastructure, two services, seamless run for Delhi Merit RRTS and Merit Metro trains. The National Capital Region Transport Corporation, NCRTC, is spearheading the execution of the Regional Rapid Transit System, RTS, project, connecting Delhi, Ghaziabad, and Merit. The Merit Metro project stands as a milestone in Indian rail infrastructure, integrating both the Regional Rapid Transit System, RTS, and local metro services. This report provides an in-depth analysis of the integration of the RRTS and the upcoming Phase 1 of local metro systems in Merit, focusing on technical details and specifications, infrastructure development, costs, and benefits of the Merit Metro project, emphasizing its innovative approach to optimizing resources operational aspects, and the historical context of the project. Those viewers who are interested in getting more information regarding the Delhi Merit RRTS system and its updates as well as about the Merit Metro system, please find links within the playlist at the end of this video, to related videos which have been previously uploaded in this channel. Details for this video has been gathered from various news reports of May 2, 2024 and May 1, 2024. Hi friend! Welcome back to SciTech Buzz 1 channel. We wish to sincerely thank all the new subscribers of this channel. We have observed that 97% of our viewers haven't subscribed to our channel. If you haven't as yet subscribed, kindly consider doing so, after watching this video, since it would encourage us to do more. Watch this interesting video until the end so that you will not miss out on all the details. Historical Context, The RRTS Project Overview the RRTS project, spanning 82 kilometers and estimated at 30,274 Indian rupees crore, aims to provide a rapid transit system connecting Delhi with its neighboring cities. Currently, a 34 kilometer stretch from Sahibabad to Modingar, north, is operational. By May, the operations will extend up to Merit, south. The Merit section of the project covers 23 kilometers with 13 stations, including four dedicated RRTS stations which will also be local metro stations, Merit, South, Shatabdinagar, Bigumpal, and Madipuram, along with other nine dedicated local metro stations. This project is part of the larger plan to decongest the National Capital Region, NCR, by providing a fast, reliable, and efficient transportation system. Development of the RRTS Project Chronology The RRTS project was conceptualized to address the growing transportation needs of the NCR. The project received approval from the Government of India and the respective state governments involved. Construction began in phases, with the Ghaziabad section becoming operational from Sahibabad to Modingar, north, covering a 34-kilometer stretch. The ongoing construction aims to extend the operational route up to Merit, south. Project Components Route The RRTS project connects Delhi, Ghaziabad, and Merit, covering a total distance of 82 km. The Merit section of the project spans 23 km and includes 13 stations. Key Station Details 1. Dedicated RRTS Stations Merit South Shatabdi Nagar Bigumpal Madipuram 2. Local metro stations Partapur Rithani Brahmapuri Merit, Central Baisali MES Colony Dorli Merit, North Madipuram, Depot Cost Analysis for Merit Metro the Merit Metro project comes with an estimated cost of approximately 8,575 Indian rupees crore, approximately $1.15 billion. This investment aims to enhance connectivity in the National Capital Region, NCR, by integrating the RRTS and local metro services. Cost Breakdown Infrastructure Development Rolling Stock Acquisition Station Construction Signaling and Telecommunication Systems Land Acquisition Project Management Costs Contingencies Integration of RRTS and Local Metro Systems 
NCRTC has adopted an innovative approach by integrating the RRTS and local metro systems in Merit. This integration, with the help of tailored stations in Merit by NCRTC, is designed to ensure seamless operation and efficient interchange between the two systems, providing commuters with enhanced connectivity and convenience. The stations are designed to accommodate both systems efficiently, facilitating easy interchange for passengers. Infrastructure Design Station Design Stations in Merit are tailored to accommodate both RRTS and Metro trains efficiently. The Merit, South, Station, for instance, is designed with three platforms, two for RRTS and a separate one for the Metro. Other stations, such as Begum Pool, Baisali, and Merit, Central, feature two platforms and four tracks to facilitate the operation of both RRTS and Metro services. At most of the nine metro stations, the outer platforms and tracks will be reserved for local metro services, while RRTS trains will run non-stop on the inner tracks. Train Identification and Features RRTS Trains, Namo Bharat These trains consist of six coaches with an operational speed of 160 km per hour. RRTS trains are easily identifiable by their silver coaches with red stripes. Metro trains. Metro trains comprise three coaches with a maximum operational speed of 120 km per hour. They are distinguished by mustard colored stripes for easy identification. The interior color scheme of metro trains is distinct from that of RRTS trains. Seating arrangements in metro trains include both 2x2 two two transverse and longitudinal seating. Passenger facilities. Capacity and amenities. RRTS trains can accommodate up to 1,400 passengers, while metro trains have a capacity of 700 passengers. Metro trains are equipped with various amenities, including comfortable standing space, luggage racks, CCTV cameras, mobile charging facilities, dynamic route maps, infotainment systems, auto control ambient lighting, stretchers, wheelchairs, and other facilities for passengers' convenience. Operational Details Speed and Frequency RRTS trains operate at an operational speed of 160 km per hour, while metro trains have a maximum speed of 120 km per hour. RRTS stations are spaced at intervals of 5 to 7 km, whereas metro stations are situated 1 to 2 km apart. Metro trains cater to shorter distances, offering increased frequency for local commuters. Milestones and Future Plans The integration of RRTS and Metro systems in Merit represents a significant milestone in India's transportation infrastructure. This innovative approach of utilizing the same infrastructure for both systems promises integrated and efficient transportation for commuters. Current Status The first Metro train set for the Merit Metro module has arrived at the Duhai Depot from Savli, Gujarat. Routine testing of the metro train is underway in preparation for the trial run. Currently, 34 kilometers of the RRTS project in Ghaziabad is operational from Sahibabad to Modingar, north. Completion Timeline NCRTC aims to complete the entire 82 kilometers RRTS route by June 2025. Future Expansion NCRTC plans, as part of Phase 2, are to extend the RRTS link from Ghaziabad to Jevar in Greater Noida, which may include a local metro module. Conclusion The integration of RRTS and metro systems in Merit is a testament to the innovative approach adopted by NCRTC to revolutionize urban transportation in the NCR. With its innovative approach, the project optimizes resources by utilizing the same infrastructure for both systems. NCRTC aims to provide commuters with seamless, efficient, and comfortable travel options. This integration sets a precedent for future urban transportation projects, demonstrating the feasibility and benefits of combining different modes of public transport to create a comprehensive and efficient network. As NCRTC moves forward with its ambitious plans, the Merit Metro system stands as a model for urban transportation integration in India. Stay tuned for further developments on these projects.
Do let us know your thoughts on the subject in the comments section. My friend, if you have found any value in this video, then kindly click on like button as an encouragement to create better quality content. Please share this video amongst your family members, friends, and in your social media network so that this information might benefit others. Don't forget to subscribe to SciTech Buzz One channel so that you will not miss out on any of our forthcoming videos. Thank you.